<clears throat> okay, so one year ago, the Ugandan Knuckles meme took off for some reason. And everybody was talking about it. And this is around the same, and March of 2018 was around the same time the meme has died. Okay, so the meme has been dead for well over a year until Big Sungus came around. And to all those people who are going to kind of dislike this video and comment dead meme, well, I'll be explaining why the Ugandan Knuckles exists in the first place, why it was popular, and why this why does Ugandan Knuckles exist? Because this is the next meme I could think about. I think the next episode will probably be about Saggy from Scooby Doo, but Ugandan Knuckles was given a nickname to the description of a character Knuckles from Sonic the Hedgehog by YouTuber Craig Zilla, and he would and all, and him and those other people would replace the way he says, "Do you know the way?" And memes are associated from the film Who Kept Captain Alex and Zulu, and the character associated with the expression "Do you know the way?" and a mock African expression. Previously, he says, "Well, do you know the way?" and basically, people in VR would sat to start doing it over and over again. That's what Uganda Knuckles is. But now we will be talking about the origin of the Ugandan Knuckles. Ugandan Knuckles origined by by YouTuber Virtually Vain upward poses of himself. No, <coughs> for uploaded footage of himself we all playing an African drug ward in the game Call of Duty, saying lines like "Follow me, I know the way." So on below, which is on Know Your Meme. This is the original video. Moving on. Within two years, the video accumulated around 10 million views and a lot of comments. On February 20th, 2017, YouTuber Greg Zilla uploaded a review of the 2014 game Sonic Lost World, which featured a parody animation of Knuckles. And the video basically created the Knuckles Sing remixes. Fans of the Switch streamer Frozen Coventry reference various jokes to the Ugandan Warriors while playing PUBG. Additionally, viewers have been known to stream Sniper's channel while various Ugandan related memes on. September 15th, Ugandan Knuckles was created as a meme. But it didn't become popular until December 22nd, until YouTuber Statsy uploaded a filter Do You Not Know the Way in which a swarm of free outsets from Ugandan Knuckles. And without troll players by making quick announcements and saying, Do you not know the way? The one, Do you not know the way? was inspired by a Ugandan actual film and Ugandan, a Ugandan film, which was not that great. But the, now, how was Ugandan Knuckles spread? Why is this spread? On December 23rd, YouTuber Soil Cake published another version of this with Ugandan Knuckles called Ugandan Knuckles Tribe. On December 1st, on January 1st, YouTuber Storm uploaded a video chat called Do You Know the Way within 48 hours. The video gained almost 200,000 almost 200, views and a lot of comments. 770, in fact. YouTuber where the Jeebus McEzon submitted Uganda Knuckles Tribe video to the YouTube while well, received a lot of comments and stuff. Uganda Knuckles is a hilarious meme that take, took in gaming by Storm by Worms World. And then, for a month, Uganda Knuckles was just everywhere. Uganda Knuckles also had. Its own accusations. Uganda Knuckles was, was was of course said as racist. Which is probably one of the reasons why the meme died as well. Uganda Knuckles was considered racist because it was making fun of Ugandan stereotypes um, from the movie. Even though it's from, even though these lines are from a movie, so they're technically not racist, as the from the very latest. Making fun of a Ugandan movie that was not that great. But then Razor said that, that basically Ugandan Knuckles Razor is away. And Razor no do posted a racist meme. And this is how Ugandan Knuckles died. Ugandan Knuckles died ever since they was called a racist meme. And that's basically what it is. The meme died after January. And there were still some people who still searched it up. But... There was a search interest over time. I don't know if it would so. Ah, come on. Come on. Ah, come on. So it. 
Okay, let's look up Google Trends then. Google Trends. Ugandan Knuckles. Is Google see Uganda Knuckles? It became part. It just started declining, and then because of Big Sungus, it went up, and then it just started declining. So Uganda Knuckles is a dead meme, and only became more popular because of um Big Sungus. And for a short brief period of time, Uganda Knuckles came back for a little bit. The past past five years, man, it's a much more reasonable one to sell. There we go, you got knuckles on um, February went up and it just declined. And that's the buff and death of Uganda Knuckles. Now you know who is the real Uganda Knuckles. Now you can pride yourself of knowing who is really Uganda Knuckles and why does Uganda Knuckles exist as a meme? Why did it, why was it so popular for such a short time? That's the history of Uganda Knuckles. Goodbye.